Hello and today we have everything about Gravitac. Gravitac is the Omnitrix's DNA sample of a Galilean from the planet Kepler. Gravitac is literally a living planet. He is a large, bulky, reddish-brown alien with rocky skin, a giant mouth and a molten lava planet core at the center of his body. His feet are tan with three toes. He has three fingers and one thumb on each hand. He wears black shorts with green stripes and a green belt with white stripes. He wears the Omnitrix symbol on his forehead. Negative Gravitac is magenta and red colored and has red eyes. His Ultimatrix symbol is red and is in the same location as Ben's Gravitax Omnitrix symbol. Bad Ben as Gravitac is violet colored and has mint green eyes. His core and gravity powers are purple. His Omnitrix symbol is mint green and is in the same location as Ben's Gravitax Omnitrix symbol. Gravitac can control gravity to manipulate the weight and motion of objects, allowing him to suspend and levitate targets in the air, send them flying back or forth, or slam them down to the ground with hand gestures. His control over gravity allows him to change its direction, allowing him to telekinetically send targets flying upwards or across the air as if they were falling. He can also place objects into an orbital track causes them to fly in circles at various speeds. When using his powers, he emits an aura of hazy energy. He can even form this energy into walls, barriers, and domes. Gravitac can make matter or energy orbit around him whenever he retracts his limbs, giving himself the appearance of a planetoid sphere. Gravitac can manipulate his own gravity in order to levitate, curling his body into a planetoid. Gravitac possesses enhanced strength as shown when he punched a hole in the ground when trying to hit the time beast. Gravitac has enhanced durability, as shown when he endured physical attacks from Fistrix armor. Gravitac can survive in space, as he is a living planetoid. If he takes large amounts of damage to his core, Gravitac may enter meltdown and explode. Gravitac's large body makes it hard to move in small spaces. Sudden changes of mass can throw off Gravitac's orbit. Gravitac cannot stop someone from using energy-based attacks. Gravitac first appeared in Age Old from the past. Gravitac defeated Fistric and saved the Megafuts with Rook's help. In Hot Stretch, Gravitac attempted to battle the Kraho, but couldn't when the Omnitrix timed out. In Bilgax Must Croak, Gravitac defeated Adia, 6677, and 88. In While You Were Away, Gravitac trapped Sheriff Watson and Rook Shar. In food around the corner, Gravitac was used to negotiate a peace treaty between Apoplexians and Luodans. This is because Galileans are considered wise and patient. However, the Hulex landed on him, trying to destroy his core and cause him to explode. He was able to revert before that happened. In for a few brains more, Gravitac broke out of the proto-troop wreckage and fought Ultimate Albedo, before being defeated by Negative Armadrillo. In the Rooters of All Evil, Gravitac defeated the Rooters. In fight at the museum, Gravitac used his powers to keep Exoskull synced in the floor. In It's a Mad, Mad, Mad Ben World Part 2, Gravitac blamed Dino Mighty for not transforming him into Humongousaur on purpose. In Let's Do the Time War Again, Gravitac chased the Time Beast, trapping it and accidentally created a black hole. In Malgax Attacks, Gravitac helps Max and Luli escape from the Chimerian Hammer. In A New Dawn, Gravitac appeared for a short time when Ben was cycling through his aliens. His name comes from the combination of gravity, his main power, and attack, the way he mainly uses that power. Gravitac's concept name was Graviton early on in production of Omniverse. In the credits of Age Old from the past, Gravitac's name is spelled as Gravitone. Gravitac's gravity aura was white in the first two episodes he appeared, but starting from Bilgax Must Croak, the aura's color changed to green. Gravitac is featured on Disc 2 of Ben 10, Omniverse, Volume 1 A New Beginning. Like way big, Gravitac's size is portrayed inconsistently across his appearances. Be sure to like and subscribe or you're a racist.